सो हेलो गाइज माई सेल्फ आर ऑफ एंड यू वॉचिंग एट रेड क्रेडर यूट्यूब चैनल सो आई हैव बिन नॉट मेकिंग वीडियो सच ए लॉन्ग टाइम सो आई एम नॉट बैक विद द अमेजिंग कंटेंट एज फॉर योर्स सो इन दिस वीडियो वी गोना डिस्कस अबाउट द डब फेस्ट लेटेस्ट एंड्रॉइड थर्टीन वर्जन वी रिलीज फॉर रेडमी नोट टेन प्रो एंड वन थिंग ऑल्सो आई ऑल्सो बॉट दिस पोको एक्स फाइव प्रो एज यू कैन सी दैट एंड आई विल गोना मेक द वीडियोज ऑनसो ऑन इट सो इफ यू नो एनी of Poco X5 Pro users so you can also share the channel to get them also delivered the Poco X5 Pro content so now talking about that and for the Redmi Note 10 videos we are late because no such good roms were present right now but i will surely make that videos on it so first of all let us start with the smoothness part so as you can see that if i close any application there is a smoothness that i like so far but sometimes it creates a jitter and lag that I don't think so that it might going to happen because it uses the Vantom kernel but although it is the best one that you can use right now in terms of smoothness now talking about the customization part let us dive in and talk about some of the customizations i am not going to need detail with the customization because that makes the video really long and it goes your all this is the battery settings and everything is working out there in this the clock settings you can see that everything is already known from your all and miscellaneous you get the status bar lyric option wear logo you can en enable logo as like here you can see that here is the dub fest logo over there so there isn't any issues with the dub uh, logos option you get the notification count and you can see that per app notification count is being working over there now if i talk about the notification option in the dub space you get the read ticker and quick settings you get the much of the customization to get quick settings delivered to you all now talk about the lock screen ui here's the options that you also know nothing to talk about more and here the general settings comes out and what key animation style is there no one can use this this is too old everyone doesn't like but some of the people like so it depends on people to people ui style is there if you can select the pitch black the ui gets changed and you can see that ui colors gets change if you click on the solarized option some of the ui things were like going to change if you do a subtle restart to your device now talk about the customization already done with it and qs theme style you can see that outline is present and if you click on the outline option you can see that the ui gets totally changed over there now here's the pulse options come out and lock screen pulse is there everything that you like were present nothing is being equipped out in this custom room now this is all the part now let's talk about the next part which is all about the benchmarks so let us dive into that part so first of all i run the 3d mark application to get the results so i have run the wildlife and you can see that in the wildlife it scored 115 means 115 and average fps that we are getting so what is 6.70 which is not bad it is good scores you know talking about the slingshot test you can see that the overall score is 2707 and maximum fps you get on the 732g processor is 60 fps that is being supported over there this device doesn't overclock and i suggest many people then don't overclock your device it happens a very lot of much issues around there now this is a safety net stitches that i have took and it is passed this is a cpu throttling test i am happy with the cpu throttling test device get not too much hotter Now this is talk about the DRM info. You are getting the L1 certification over there. Use Netflix, Amazon Prime at full HD if you have that plan. And if you don't have that, don't use. Uh, this is the Geekbench results. I am totally happy with these results. This is not bad. This is a two good results. And this is the Geekbench CPU result that is also performing fine. Now this is the benchmark portion that I have already been covered. If you talk about me the device certification or not. we are getting so far the device certification you can see that the device is being certified almost without any issues you can see above there and this pixel can back up unlimited photos and videos at no extra cost and there is a call recording also available but it doesn't inform any your opponent to get your call being recorded so now this is all the part <coughs> all the part about these things Now let us dive into another part, which is overall UI feel and look. So see, this is okayish uh, 
better than okay shrom because you get the miui camera also and it works without any issues so you can also access that now second thing is that the stability overall the rom is okay not very good battery consumption is also good i generally got up 8 hours of sot without any issues the charging is quick fast what you are equipped with a 33 watt and now you are also getting the dolby atmos support which performs good and creates a good level of sound in your device now if i talk about in the systems option you get the android version 13 over there with the cute and nice easter egg of and android 13 that you can customize with your own the chain log is been available right there which is one second let's see here this is the where chain logs you can see that here you can use to recommended recovery from here you can see that you have to click here and i will give this link in the telegram of my channel and this is the us latest firmware of mui 14 to avoid people must clean flash with the uh, orange fox yeah you have to flash with of orange fox recovery without any issues changing the kernel probably lead to issues of custom kernels don't have requirements commitment now uh, talking about those things you are also getting a dub fest updater over there you can update over there but i need i what i recommend is that clean flash your rom this is a gestures option this is the normal ones nothing is new nothing is gone thermo profiles is still not working i don't know why what's the issue with the android 13 customers that thermo profiles won't work so this is all for the review and if i talk about the network interception that is good no issues with the call quality that i have faced so far so if you really did enjoyed watching this video give a thumbs up to this video and if you don't want and if you don't like don't go and subscribe and don't like but if you still subscribe it is better to me so thanks for watching videos till then bye bye have a great day